something else that you've done that was just magical was you um, were actually the director and producer on Between the World of, and Me, um, you know, which is the iconic piece by Ta-Nehisi Coates. Um, I was there the first night. It was magical. And, and it's also now been a film on HBO Max. Um, tell us a little bit about that project, because I think people should go back and watch that if they didn't catch it on HBO Max, because it was really powerful. Sure, yeah. So this was just, the film was really an opportunity, um, like with the stage play, really to bring the book to life um, in a different realm. Um, so we had, um, you know, folks like, um, uh, folks like from Angela Bassett to Angela mm-hmm. Davis to Yara Shahidi uh, to Oprah um, as readers in, um, as, as, you know, monologue, you know, doing monologues from the book to Mahershala Ali um, performing um, alongside one another. Um, and, and for me, it was it was it, for us it was really an opportunity to build bring a community together to have this very urgent conversation that the book has is what does it mean to be black in america in the age when the wrote it 2015 in the age of 20 Trayvon Martin, but when we did the film, it was in the age of Breonna Taylor and George Floyd. So we wanted to have a really urgent conversation with the world, um, while at the same time, you know, create a beautiful piece of work that will provide a respite for healing and transformation. Um, so that was really the purpose of the film, and we had some really amazing collaborators from Legacy to Black Thought. Um, um, who made it some um, amazing art that was a part of the film uh, to Jason Moran, who did our score. Um, yes. And it was just beautiful collaborators, and, and we're really proud of the film. 